guys, so we got a new toy. We got some lavalier mics or lapel mics, whatever you want to call them, just so we have better sound quality. But I wanted to show you how we did it. Well, of course, we did it for cheap. So the mic we picked up is the JKC2. It's 40 bucks on Amazon. The only thing is, this microphone is designed to work with sound recorders, so it comes down to having a different connector. So this is called the TRS connector, which means tip, ring, sleeve. And this is the connector you need, because we are gonna use our phones for recording this. So on a phone, you have a TRRS, which is tip, ring, ring, sleeve, which is designed for headphones, headsets, if you will. So it's got headphones, controller, and mic all in one. Hence, connector is much more complex. So what you need to do is cut and solder the correct connector so you can use it on your phone. And in our situation, we both have LG phones, so it was pretty straightforward. No resistor needed, apparently just works. So now we're gonna show you how Check to- Check that thing out, by the way. It's unreal. Yeah, here's uh, the end product. Now okay. it's white because we use the cheap Chinese Apple red yeah, so, headphones. So yeah, that's the thing. This actual mic is 40 bucks. And then these no-name China headphones were about a dollar. 15 for 10 bucks. So as long as you've got the connector, you're good to go. And now we're gonna show you how it's actually built together. Cause then you've got yourself a recorder. These head headphones have already been mangled, it looks like, which is fine for our purposes. We're leaving maximum length on this in case we ever need to film like uh, sounds from the engine bay or anything like that when we film our car videos. So we figured we'll leave it as long as possible. And also we were first time testing it. So in case you got to recut and resolder, you got extra length. We're gonna cut it right here under the split. Need some wire cutters. And we're gonna strip this. Inside is what, four cables? I think it's five. You got uh, green, blue. Uh, the copper one is ground, the, you also have a red and you have a red copper. Yeah. Like intermittent orange thing. So we're using the red and the copper. In any case, red is microphone, copper is ground, and that's the two that we need. Everything else you can disregard. So with that said, we're gonna go ahead and cut off the ones we're not using. Now you just gotta solder it. Then we're gonna use some shrink tubing because once you connect these, you don't want them to be touching inside, which means we take the microphone now. So this will effectively strip the cable gently. Okay, same thing, you want to prepare your wires. All right, so for those of you wondering the colors, it's very simple. The copper goes on the copper because those are your ground wires. And then the red and the white are bridging together because that's our microphone. So what we're gonna do first is get some of this shrink wrap. This one is gonna be covering the whole thing and it's fatter. All right, so there you have it. This is the finished product. This is a test so you can hear what it sounds like. Um, the first part of the video was shot with a shotgun mic, so you'll hear the difference. If you have any questions on how to do this, feel free to ask in the comments. Uh, and please like, subscribe, and follow us.